When Michelangelo was asked how he was able to create such a magnificent sculpture of his David, Michelangelo reportedly replied that I just envisioned David within the stone and chipped away all that wasn't David. Yeah, old Michael was uh, quite a meme maker ahead of his time, I would say, because a vision without work is just a dream. We all know that in order to create anything of value, you have to do the work behind it. Now, I'm not one to dismiss visions and dreams. They're part of the process. But doing the everyday work, the everyday grunt and grind kind of stuff behind create, creating something of value is work. And that's what I want to talk a little bit about here. Part of the uh, vision that I have going forward is, you know, involves staying in shape, you know, doing my yoga and staying in shape, which is getting more and more difficult at my age. It's difficult mentally, I think. Physically, I could still do it. But, you know, having the determination to get up and, 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 and work hard, you know, exercise physically, at least four times a week is becoming more and more difficult and my body doesn't respond the way that it that it used to respond. Today on Facebook, this picture popped up. This is a Bikram Chowdhury and Bikram is the man that I learned uh, how to be a yoga teacher from back in 2005. And uh, Bikram has a lot of noise around him. He's a very controversial guy with political and social issues. That's not what I want to talk about here. What I want to talk about in this picture is this guy is 80 years old. Now, just sitting in lotus position, which he's doing in this picture, is a pretty impressive thing for a man his age. I used to be able to do it not that long ago, but right now I can only get into half lotus, which I'm sitting in now, which speaks to where I'm at. I have a, a vision as to what I want to do going forward with my photography and my video stuff and, 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 you know, paying models here in Thailand, you know, paying it forward a little bit. And that's all coming together nicely. But key to all of that is for me to maintain my physical and mental fitness. And the way I do that is through my practice of yoga. So, you know, that, that's, that's part of, uh, of the hard work of what I want to accomplish going forward. You see, Michelangelo had a, uh, a benefactor, an investor, if you will, that he had a contentious relationship with, and that was a pope. Uh, he had, uh, you know, jealous cardinals sniping at his heels, claiming that his, uh, his, you, his naked sculptures were indecent. And, you know, they were just a jealous bunch of, you know, little people sniping at his, his sniping behind him because, you know, he, uh, he, he had the ear of the Pope, that kind of thing. A lot of jealousy involved. So, you know, he had to deal with that. He had to deal with carpenters. He had to deal with masons. He had to deal with dozens and dozens of workmen of all kinds, you know, people to build scaffolds. You know, it was more than just a vision. It was more than just envisioning David within the stone. Now, that's a nice metaphor. And like I said, memes are fun and, and helpful. You know, they can inspire and but you gotta do the work. Are you hungry? different ideas and, and ways of living, ways of being, attitudes and, and ways of inspiring and putting together visions uh, and doing the work uh, to, to create results. And uh, in my next video, I'm going to pull all of those ideas together in one video and, and just kind of review them all and talk about how they're working or not working and, and, and the ideas and visions that I have uh, right now and maybe how you can apply them to your life. <laughs> 
it's nice to be young, right? I'll get there. I'll be there. Yeah, you'll see me one day with that lotus. It's not that deep. You can go a little bit deeper here. But yeah. Talk from God. <laughs> see you the next time. <laughs> Huh? It's good. It's perfect. <laughs>